Hello, beautiful. Welcome back to another plan with me this week. So, firstly, before I forget, I want to remind you guys that tomorrow is the last day of the YouTube giveaway and also my Instagram giveaway. So, if you guys have not entered yet, please do so soon after this video or even pause this video and go check out the giveaway video because it will end tomorrow. I'm gonna show you guys how I got my inspiration for this week's theme. This is my husband's study nook. It's just a tiny room, but it's tucked away at the corner of our house on the main floor. Whenever I need some quiet time or downtime, I just come into this room and just sit on the chaise and stare outside the window. This is our backyard, and this is what I stare into. And look at it, this is where I got my inspiration. It just was so peaceful and quiet that day and with the snow and I'm like, wow, it's so enchanting and ding, the idea just came off my head and I just got so inspired by this scenery. And not to mention the little toys that my daughter plays when she just leaves it on the windowsill. So I'm like, oh, enchanted forest, cause that there, Little figurine is a fairy and with the animals. So there's the snowy owl. I don't know if you've seen my last week plan with me. The Arctic love, that's, you know, was part of the idea there too, that of the owl, the white owl. But anyways, yes, so this whole scene here, the backyard and my little daughter's little playing Lego thingy, just inspired me for this week's spread. So this week themes color are ice blue, teal, and plum, different shades of plum. I didn't add any green to this week color palettes because to me when it's green, it's spring, it's summer. And I want to still stick to winter theme because we are still in January. We are planning January 11th to January 17th. Let's get started. Let me lay my headers down first. What I did differently this week is actually on my header it says to do instead of today because I figured that's what I have to do on that day. And if I was to put the header today, it's things that's gonna happen today. So I think I just realized when I was creating these stickers was that I've been doing my plan with me all wrong. Now for my checklist flags, I'm going to set it from the darkest going to the lightest. Next is my bottom washi. I don't know why I'm having so much trouble with this. But then I realized that the bottom Prints actually show through the washi, so I have to wet it out as you can see here. And I'm gonna try this again. Next is my sidebar, and the January flag was too dark, so I have to wipe that out. And I'm gonna put my sidebar sticker. Next thing I wanna place my full boxes down. I've made these stickers to fit either two of the boxes or single boxes, it depends, because it is a, I guess, a panoramic view and you could rearrange it to however you like it to be. Going forward, I'm gonna film my plan with me on Friday instead of Sunday and upload and edit them on Monday. Reasons, cause weekends are for family, right? Next, I'm gonna put my heart teardrop to indicate my grocery days. I created these mini happy planner stickers here, so I'm just gonna put it there. Before I place the flag down, I decided I have to put my washi up there first.
this Friday, which is tomorrow, is our last day of our YouTube and Instagram giveaway. So I just placed a flag there to let me know, remind me. And I'm gonna do some Instagram pictures on Wednesday and Saturday. And that was my blog sticker to remind me that tomorrow is Freebie Friday. So I have to work on my blog tomorrow. So this week's design for my half boxes and my quarter boxes and flags and everything is very plain because it's just solid and no prints because I usually do prints. The reason for that is that I know that this spread will be very overwhelmed with the enchanted flowers that's going to grow out of this whole spread. So that's why I left my boxes, my flags, and background design all plain color, just solid colors. So I'm so bummed that my camera just stopped recording. So as you can see, I was working already on the flowers and decorating the page. I didn't make any extra blank headers for the bottom as you can see right there for the weekend part so I decided to use this glittery blue washi and I'm just gonna cut it down to size flower vines and again these are all my creations I felt that my sidebar needed something else so I got this quote sticker from the Mambi quote sticker book and it says getting lost is not a waste of time. I felt that I could get lost into this spread into the forest this enchanted winter forest. So obviously I need more flowers so I'm just going to speed this process up because it took me forever just to cover everything with all these little flowers and its little petals and leaves. Finally, it's done. I am going to start writing in this week's spread. I felt that this spread took forever because of the flower sticker, <laughs> but I'm happy how it came out. And my absolute favorite part, putting it back in. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's plan with me and I didn't bore you with the music, but I love how this week came out and what I imagined in my mind came out to life and I'm so happy it worked out. 
So if you like this week's spread, remember to give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe. Also, if you have not entered my YouTube giveaway yet, as I said, tomorrow's the last day. Please do so. I'll put the link under the description box. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Happy planning.